Good evening, everybody. This is your girl. You know the one. Bug at Betty that is. Look at here, y'all. I got a touchy subject. And I need I, what I really need. I'm going to tell you what I really need. I really need Shirley, the church lady. I need for her to see this. Because I need to ask her a question. What do you do in a situation when someone come to you and tell you, um, now you at church, and they tell you, um, you act like you in the club. What club <laughs> you been to? Now, I, granted now, everybody bounce ain't the same. You know, some folk got a little groove in they bounce. And, uh, and, but but you can't tell them because they bouncing that they can't, uh, can't be in the choir. Or they need to tone it down. See, because now, see, this is this just means, it's just book at. If you tell me that, hear my response. I appreciate you telling me, but you can't put me in a box. Feel me? You can't box me in. I'm like the little drummer boy. I just beat my drum like he did. The little drummer boy, it was a bunch of drummers there that night. But one drummer stood out because he hit his drum so... That's the way he done here. And he eased on out in front so he could be front and seller. That's the way it is for folk that you don't understand. They rock. You don't understand they little bounce. Because they trying to stand out. And evidently, they doing exactly what they want to because you looking. And if you weren't looking and doing the same, you might feel like they feel. You know what I'm saying? These people, are, I mean, that's why, folk, that's why some of these churches is dying out because you got these stiff necks in there that you, you, you can't do nothing. You, what? Dress down. You better not come in here with no jeans on. What? You can't come to church comfortable. You got to be prim and proper. Mm -hmm. All the time. I don't know nowhere in the Bible it said you got to dress up. They said they had a wedding. They didn't say how they would dress. So, Jesus still came. He wasn't looking at the clothes. <laughs> if he looking at the clothes, a lot of y'all going to make it. But that ain't what he looking at. You know, sometimes I feel like this right here. I feel like sometimes people miss the message when the pastor preaching. He be preaching you know, y'all be hollering, amen, but you ain't paying attention because he be talking right to you. Be all up in your stuff, and y'all miss it. Still acting up. Still acting up at the church. Yep. Yeah, I'm calling y'all out. Because that's why the church ain't growing. Because y'all y'all don't want this to happen. You don't want that to happen. You don't want the Holy Spirit to come up in here. And because... And when it come up in here and hear everybody but you, <laughs> Ew, that's going to be sad. Huh? Y'all better be careful how y'all be messing with people. People in the church trying to grow and stuff. And y'all, mm, talking about how they rock. Ooh-wee. I mean, really. Yeah, Y'all know. Y'all know I'm telling the truth. Because some of y'all done left the church for that very reason. 
you better go back. Don't let them stop. What? Because see, I look at it like this right here. When God started giving out blessings, yes, um, he gave me my, he gave me my set of blessings, and he gave you your set. Your set is different from mine. Holla at me. Why don't Miss Shirley, the church lady? Holla at Bug at if you if you see this here. Somebody y'all reach out and tell her she need to watch it. And I, Cause I need to know what do you do with them? I know the Bible said pray. Mm. Okay. God ain't through working yet. <laughs> but but pray we shall. Dear Lord, give them. <laughs> Amen. Holla.